And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And we're very much looking forward to bringing you league action today. It's Stade de Reims, and they take on Le Havre. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward, and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. And a look at the starting lineup for Reims. Well, the two wide players are great in 1v1 situations, and their movement is also very good. But it's the midfield three that will need to control the flow of the game. And introducing the visitors lineup today. Well, it's great to see them playing with the front, but for it to work, they need to have a good understanding. They need to link up with each other and provide a different set of skills. And the match is underway. Well, the referee opting for the lenient approach this time. I think it's a great bit of refereeing. Everybody now knows the next foul will be punished. Clattered away. Firing it towards goal. In it goes. An early goal. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. One nil then. It needs an accurate cross. Could be still alive. Well, threat averted. Well, what a good piece of goalkeeping that was. Oh, Stewart's a chance. Oh, it strikes the bar. Denied by the bar. Back in play here. And holding on to it at the second time of asking. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Well, the referee wasn't going to let that go. Dumornay Luan Joly Well they're on the scent of something positive Opportunity And take it away Well taking on that shot and not missing by much Well that would have been an excellent goal but it means everything is still up for grabs here
Good work to regain possession. Well, not a bad plan of action, but through to the goalkeeper it goes. That is how to apply the pressure. Davis in possession. Must be! And they've done it to square the game once again. Exhilarating. Well, here's the replay, and just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. So, back underway. One goal apiece here. And the pass not quite accurate enough. And a throw in then. They've given it away. Wants to attack from the wide areas. It's got to be! Well, hit with ferocity when accuracy was required. Ushen, Joly, Merci du Mornay. Well, they might be onto something. The end product just wasn't there. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. They're using her considerable strength to shield the ball. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. To jump in front. Surely. No way through. And a goal it is. Just what she was hoping to contribute. Well, just watch this again. A change of pace, a change of direction, and a decent finish. That's a very good goal. Well, as they kick off again, 2-1, the current state of affair. Well, totalling up all the stoppages, we'll have two additional minutes. Well, she's gliding through. Oh, she's broken things up magnificently. So, the whistle then. We're up the halfway stage in this match.
So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. And a chance to whip it in here. Getting in there to intercept. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Can they convert? Real chance. Oh, it strikes the bar. And foiled only by the crossbar. There it is. Two to the good now. And that gives them a buffer. Well, here it is again, and all credit to the goal scorer, but you have to ask questions of the keeper. She's got to have that covered for me. No wonder she's frustrated with herself. Well, that's a tale of four goals in this match now. 3-1 it is. Well, as you can see, the visitors have had most of the ball and they've made good use of it. They really have played some good attacking football and they look like scoring more. Yes, it's going to plan and they might be able to carve out another chance. Oh, marvellous save. Great goalkeeping. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Short corner taken. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. And options in the centre. Now, what can they do from here? And it might be... And now she scored not once, but twice. Thoroughly enjoying herself out there. Well, here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. And just look at that finish. 1v1 against the keeper, and she hits it with power. It's a great goal. Goals in plentiful supply, 4-1 currently. Driven in, well it didn't happen for them in attack. Bussy. Tremendous ball played through. Almost found its target, but cutting it out in the end. High pressing at its best. Well, on you go, says the referee. Advantage. Good looking ball. There could be a chance now. Tenacious tackling. Excellent defending there. So the final whistle almost upon us and this is not exactly what the home fans had in mind when they arrived at the ground today, Stuart. Well, this is certainly a performance to forget because they've been totally outplayed today. How many times have they been opened up during this game? They have to defend better than this. It's been a dismal display. Ushen. Into the advanced position. And the cross not sufficiently well played in. 
Well, it comes down to the final five minutes. And giving it away. Ushen. Luan Jolie. Kessia Busi. Happy to take on the shot. Nicely saved. And with play having stopped, a chance for the referee to go back and hand out the caution. And over comes the corner. Still not clear. And there goes the final whistle. It's gone the wrong way as far as the home fans are concerned. It was the nature of the performance more than anything else. They never got out of second gear and were completely dominated all over the park. Tell you what though, I wouldn't want to be in that dressing room right now.